what's up everybody and welcome back here to the channel Tashiria Drifter with a new update from the devs they did update it as you can see we have a amazing FD RX7 I have already uh, put some money into this thing doing the full wide body kit and you know basically RPF ones and well we have the factory motor in it we are running 1.5 bar of boost at 8700 RPMs and today we are just going to go shred this car and have some fun with it and see what this FC, FD, FC, to see what this FD can do here for today. We are at 324 horsepower, so we're going to see how this thing shreds at different tracks, maybe go online and maybe do a battle or two for today's episode. So make sure you guys follow me on Instagram and Twitter, all of which are found in the description box below. Let's go shred this FD. So I think first we're going to take it to the open city in Siberia night. And, well, see what this thing can do and shred this thing sideways. Have some fun and see how the new FD works out. Quick acceleration in the third. Really hard turn. Didn't turn hard enough. Well, so we've already pretty much wrecked our car. So we have to see if we can't salvage ourselves here. It's a little bit better. car is very twitchy but super fun to drive kick it around probably should have kicked it sooner third gear not my friend still definitely trying to get used to the handling characteristics of the game it's definitely very different like I've said from other games I've played with the way the grip factor is and everything but it does once you get it it is satisfying, like there we go. Bang it in third, go to second. Just bang this thing in second gear. A bit of feather the throttle, stay off the wall. Oh, I thought we were just gonna tap it. But unfortunately, we kinda just uh, smacked into it. So the FC, definitely a cool looking car with all the different options and stuff like that. As you can see, I've just done a full wide body, took the hood off, and took the headlights out. Kinda give it that little uh, drift missile like exo front end look that I do like. There we go. Now we're getting the hang of the car. I haven't changed my grip factors or anything from my other cars, but it seems to be working. I probably should get a little bit more grip in this car. It looks like the grip factor should be a little bit higher on this car. Oh! does like the higher RPM zone. I could kick it up to a 10 or 11,000 RPMs. So, I think we got a little bit of a handle of it. Let's go online and see if there's anybody online we can go against and maybe do a 1v1. See, 1 of 20, 20 of 20, 1 of 20, 3, 4. I'm trying to find a room with, like, 1 of 2. But I don't think I'm going to find one right now, so we're going to try that again. Now we'll try and make one, but I don't want to sit there and wait. There was a huge list there, but I didn't see any. 20 of 20. 1 of 20. 0 of 0. I don't think we're going to find anybody wanting to battle today. So maybe if I create one, somebody will uh, want to jump in on the FDRX7 and see if they want to go toe-to-toe -to -toe with me here on Hashiria Drift. I'm saying that wrong. I apologize. So they did release new rules for next year's SSR season, which we're going to be going over and building a new car for, as well as ESDA prep for next season as well. I don't think anybody's going to want to. So we're just going to go online, see if we can't just drift with some people and have some fun. I'm trying to find out. Oh, there's one. There's a one or two. Gonna let me connect? No, oh, connect. No, oh, I found a one or two, but they don't. It's not gonna connect. Sad. Well, I thought I was gonna get into a tandem battle, but I was wrong. Look at that rotary sitting in there. So I'm trying to find a decent sized server, and I'm not sure. We'll go. I don't know. What did we just check? I think we did drift track too. Oh, we did the port with a bunch of people. We're gonna rip this car here in the port. Looks like we got another FC up there, or FD. 
don't know why I keep saying FC. Got FC on the brain. We'll hit that pole. There we go. Uh, I have a cone through my window. There it goes. Now it fell off. Get him in the third. Gotta kick it sideways. Oh! Just, just, a, just a small graze. Tearing the wall apart. Try and cut the corner here and see if we can't catch up with these people. I wanted to try and get some tandems, but unfortunately, nobody really wants to tandem. So the FC, definitely a cool car to be added to this game and super excited to, you know, see the customizing that you can have with the car. So once I can finally maybe get dialed in on how to drive the game, it might be a little bit more fun for me. But unfortunately, there's not many tracks, so you can only do this for so long, unfortunately. But it is cool to see another car come in here from the game devs. And, well, it's a beautiful car, very well done, and the body kits and everything are super aggressive and super fun. So it's kind of cool to keep seeing more and more cars coming into this game, so I will continue to bring, you know, more and more car stuff, because the building in this game is actually very fun. Being able to just take the fenders off and everything like that, and do whatever really you want with the car, and then go out there and drive it as long as you have wheels, and an engine. Can't, you can't really go out there without an engine or wheels. It will not let you. Oh, no. Oh, oh we biffed it. Alright, let's go see if we can't find another track. We're going to go run that Toge Road, actually. We're going to go drift track 2 and see how we do in the Toge with this car. We did it with our other cars. We seem to be pretty good, but see how this FC works. FD. Ah, keep saying FC. Maybe I should be running an FC. Maybe they should put an FC in this game because I keep saying FC. There we go. Now we got it. The car likes second gear right now. Just banging red line. We can tap the handbrake. Oh, right down the wall. Do a quick flick to get back in gear and transition. Just pop and fire out that exhaust and banging red line and the rotary. The turbo rotary ripping the drift track on the tow gear roads. Don't hit, don't hit, save it, save it, save it. There we go. Oh, little NK RPF1 actions underneath the corners. Oh my goodness. I knew that was going to happen. Alright, let's see. We got this. Oh, wait. I want to change view. We're going to go in first person. God, it's so much louder. Definitely looks cool. So, we're going to see if we can't do this in first person here in this FD. Okay, that turbo's cool. Like we grazed the wall and we just smacked into it. Our first person is really hard in this game. We're gonna try it in first person and see how this works. Isn't that turbo spool? Oh! As we smack straight into a pole. A little bit too much of a tap. I think we got this. Nope, we don't got it. We're gonna get off the wall. Alright, there we go. Now we're getting it. Remember right there, just a little bit of a wall tap. Banging red line. I think we got it. I think we got a handle of it now. There we go. Little first person here in this very, very loud turbo F FD. Oh, oh, 
I saw that coming. As soon as I saw that rail, I knew right away that I was going to be smacking head on into that rail. Go, rail. Wish I could have rolled over that rail, but unfortunately, that was not going to happen. So if you guys want to keep seeing this, or you guys are playing this, I know the game does not have much of it. If you want to show me your guys' pictures, make sure you send me messages on Instagram. I do appreciate all the support. And as always, I'd like to thank you guys for coming back and watching. I'm not going to make that. I don't know how we made that. No, uh, we were going to make that. I'm Evil Rabbit. I'll see you guys on the track.